How are you guys doing? This is George from Body Sketch Fitness. Today we're gonna show you guys how to build them little twigs into tree trunks. Here I'm with Tomas and he's gonna run down uh, more or less what we're gonna do today. All right, so today we're gonna be doing a volume leg workout. We're gonna end it with squat. So what we're gonna do before squat is we're gonna destroy the legs before we do squat. So we're gonna start off with leg press, followed by lunges, followed by calf raises, followed by stiff like a deadlift. Doing all of this with volume training is gonna destroy us before we do squat. And then we're gonna go to squat and we're gonna do a sets of 10 pyramid till we fail pretty much. This kind of volume work is really good for bodybuilding. So we're gonna have a lot of hypertrophy from this workout and it's hopefully gonna shred your leg so that you can build some muscle in those weak ass legs. Let's go. All right, first exercise is leg press show them the leg press. We're gonna be doing five sets of 10 and you should pick a weight that's about 60% of your max. For me, that's gonna be five plates each side. For Jorge, it's gonna be four plates each side. All right, just pick a weight you're comfortable doing five sets of 10 on. The next exercise is calf raises. As George is gonna demonstrate, you need to have complete range of motion. To do that, you have to go full dorsiflexion, which is pointing your toes towards your leg, which is the position he's in right now. Now he's gonna do plantar flexion, which is pointing your toes completely away from your leg. Now he's gonna show you guys a couple reps of how to do dorsiflexion into plantar flexion. For this exercise, we're gonna be doing four sets of 15 on a comfortable weight for your calves. Third exercise is going to be stiff leg deadlift. For this exercise, you want to have your legs at a slight angle. You don't want them completely stiff, so you don't want your knees locked. What you're going to do is you're going to grab the bar, shoulder width apart. You're going to deadlift it up. Now to do the exercise, what you're going to do is you're going to lower the weight down 
and have the bar directly over your nipples and you're only going to lower your back to 180 degrees after which you're going to pull it back up you know you did stiff leg deadlift right if you feel a stretch in your hamstring and upper calf and if you didn't feel that you probably didn't go deep enough so we're going to be doing four sets of 10 incremental weight i'm going to start at 135 but you should pick a weight that you're comfortable on The fourth exercise is going to be lunges. We're going to be doing them with weights. If you're not comfortable with doing lunges with weights, then you can just do your own body weight. What we're going to be doing is 10 steps each leg for a total of 20 steps forward and backward. We're going to be doing three sets of this. Also, if you have problems lunging, you should practice your form first and foremost because you don't want to be falling while you're doing lunges. So take it slow and easy so that you don't fall. Good. Last thing is squat. We're going to finish it off pretty hard. I mean, we've already done the whole leg once. So now we're going to finish destroying our legs by doing 5 sets of 10 squat. Your first set should be 30% of your max and your fifth set should be 70% of your max. For me personally, my weights are gonna range from 135 to 315 pounds, and I'm gonna do 10 reps each set. Again, if you're getting towards your fourth set, and if it's getting too hard and you can't do 10 reps, lower the weight so you can do the reps. It's more important to get the reps right now than to get the weight. That's because hypertrophy is all about repetitions and stimulating growth in the muscle by just shocking it so that it doesn't know what's gonna come next. Get up. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, leave some comments so that we know what you guys want to see next. And uh, remember, stay swole.